This is a book review on Built by Wendy, Coats and Jackets by Wendy Mullen. Um, one thing I love about this book is I love the spiral binding and how it lays flat, which is really, really good when you're using a step-by-step -step book for project sewing. Um, let me just briefly touch on a couple of things here. Here is the table of contents. I don't know how well this will focus. It has an introduction. Um, chapter one is um, creating coats and jackets for all occasions. Chapter two is pattern play, using them, altering them, keeping them in shape. Talks about, you know, fit and um, folding fabric and um, cutting. So it, it does have a lot of uh, basic instructions in here if you are more of a beginner sewer, but I definitely think this is a more of an intermediate book. Chapter three is um, In Stitches, which is a sewing notes for coats and jackets. Um, kind of gives just a little bit more in depth on um, different kinds of supplies you'll need, um, about sewing facings, raw openings seam allowances. Um, then over here is uh, chapter four is the fitted jacket. Um, these go into the um, basically what um, she's helping you to sew in here and I'll touch on these. I'll show you examples in the book. Um, but chapter four is the fitted jacket and out of the fitted jacket they have um, these right here that you can sew using the fitted jacket pattern which is like a pea coat and a jacket that wraps. Um, Chapter five is the basic jacket, and what you can sew using these pattern pieces is the Jackie jacket, a cute little um, sportier one called Code Orange, a poncho, and then uh, chapter six is the straight coat, which is um, the, like a Baja style, a bomber, army of one, Paddington coat, and then of course at the back there's resources, glossary, um, and some other indexes and things like that. Um, let me just kind of briefly just flip through here. Um, she does offer um, a lot of information on you know kind of what to expect in this book. Um, basically it says right here in this book I've included three patterns. The fitted jacket, the basic jacket, and the straight coat. Along with many different project ideas for customizing each one to create a wide range of styles. I picked these three basic patterns because they are templates that cover a range of silhouettes. So the way the book is, um, is kind of done here is she includes the basics called the big three. And here's the fitted jacket, the basic jacket, and the straight coat. And then included in this book are the pattern pieces, the basic pattern pieces for those jackets. Now, when you go to sew one of her jackets, you're going to have to kind of create your own templates for some of the more detailed pattern pieces. And she'll tell you, you know, how to, you know, to cut a two by four square or whatever. Um, so there is instructions on doing that, but you're not just going to be able to dive right in and start cutting pattern pieces. These are not full pattern pieces for each project. These are the basic pattern pieces. Um, so anyway, back to the, um, how she has the book done up, the big three. Then she goes into considering your shape and um, and all the different things on uh, details, um, closures. I mean, you know how to pick fabrics. And then it goes into chapter two, which is the pattern play, which is altering tools that you'll need, sizing, things like that. Um, again, just kind of browsing through here so you can kind of get a uh, better idea of what the book is set up for. So let me go ahead then and um, get into, here's a, a nice section that I liked on um, sewing linings. Let me just show you how that's set up, give you just a, kind of an idea. Um, the book is very, very basic. I mean, there's not a lot of like graphics and things like that. It's not a real pretty book. Um, there is a lot of significant information. Not a lot, a lot of detail. I really, like I said, I think you're going to have to have more immediate, um, intermediate uh, skills for this book. Um, so let me, um, here's just an idea of how she lays out a project. She'll say project one, and then she gives kind of uh, an example of it, the supplies you'll need. And then she gives some uh, different um, suggestions. Here's, you know, pattern adjustments. Um, she talks, again, shows the patterns, how to lay them out, how to um, cut them. Again, I really like these little sections here called the um, um, 
alternative basically on um, how to uh, how to design it maybe a little bit uh, different so it kind of gives you some uh, general ideas um, again and then she goes into the sewing see not a lot of detail when you go into the sewing so if you're going to have a lot of questions or you're more of a beginner then this is going to she leaves a lot of things out you kind of have to know what you're doing um, thought this was a cute little jacket here it's called the pretty baby doll again it has the supplies the pattern pieces um, how to lay it out and then sewing it and then again the little alternative here to um, create a little bit different jacket and this is getting way too long of a review so let me just briefly here's another jacket I liked the um, Jackie jacket Baja style was another one, a real cute little pullover. And again, um, she gives you a great alternative here to turn that little Baja, that little pullover jacket into a Life's a Beach, and then you've got a cute little beach cover up. So anyway, I'm just gonna briefly just kind of finish flipping through it here, and then you can kind of make your own decision. And I think this is the absolute longest review I've ever done. Um, not one of my favorite books. I'm gonna give it three out of, um, five stars you know I just I see a lot of sewing books and I've seen a lot of um, different sewing books that have a lot more cuter detail in them and I um, the pictures are better the graphics are better there's more information um, so I'm only giving this three out of five stars just because I think there is a, a better books out there but you know, a lot of people really like Wendy Mullen, and so if you're used to sewing with her and her books, then this is this would be definitely a book that you would need to buy. And if you're really wanting to add some coats and jackets into your wardrobe or sewing for other people, then um, this would be a great book.